What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be taking a look at Peyton Manning's Goodbye uh, by NFL Films. And this one was requested by Pushpack, another one, so thanks again man for recommending this one. I've, I, I've heard of Peyton Manning uh, through winning Super Bowl 50, uh, which he then, I think, he retired afterwards, so I'm guessing that this, sort of, this is all going to lead up to that moment, uh, moment, so that was pretty cool of him to to retire as a Super Bowl champion. Not many people, players get to do that, so let's just get straight into it. Looks young there. In my very first NFL game. Very first. Sounds I'm southern. Pass the tight end Marcus Pollard down the middle. And somebody hit me really hard. And after I got up, I told myself, I know I can play in this league. Helmet all messed up. Of my time in Indy, the team's struggles were agonizing. Oh no. We ended my rookie season 3 and 13. And in the process, I set the NFL rookie record for interceptions. A record that I still hold today. <laughs> Every year, I pull for a rookie quarterback to break that record. <laughs> Fast forward to my second year. I bet you do. gotten things going a little bit. We were playing the Dallas Cowboys, including Troy Aikman, Emmitt Smith, Michael Irvin, and Deion Sanders. We beat the Cowboys that week, and we let the world know that the Colts had arrived. Make no mistake about it. We were coming, and we went on to do some phenomenal things. Proud man. Like winning at least 12 games seven years in a row. Nice. And of course, winning Super Bowl 41. Nice. So he was he won it twice, 41 and 50. Honored and proud to be a part of it. There's a saying that goes, "Treat a man as he is, and he will remain as he is. Treat a man as he could be, and he will become what he should be." When I visited Denver four years ago, that John Elway had sat me down and said, Peyton, here's what we're going to do. We're going to win over 50 games, win four straight division championships. Wow. We'll beat the Patriots in two championship games. You're going to win NFL Comeback Player of the Year, another MVP. Your offense will set single season passing records. A record setting performance, his 51st touchdown pass. Wow. Peyton Manning, the most passing yards for the single season NFL record. You'll break a couple more. I love hearing about these records. Oh, I think someone commented on one of my videos saying that Peyton Manning broke. Uh... And we'll go to a couple of Super Bowls. Oh, who was it? I think I would have taken that deal. Forget the name now. Broke someone's records. When someone thoroughly exhausts an experience, they can't help but revere it. I revere football. I love the game. So you don't have to wonder if I'll miss it. Absolutely. Absolutely, I mm. will. Our children are small now, but as they grow don't up... Don't doubt it. We're going to teach them to enjoy the little things in life because one day they'll look back and discover that those really were the big things. Mm -hmm. So here are the seemingly little things that when I look into my rear view mirror have grown much bigger. I'm going to miss my battles with players named Lynch, Lewis, Thomas, Brewski, Fletcher, Dawkins, Say out. Wow, respect. Erlocker. Palomalu. I'm going to react to him. Woodson. And Reed. And with coaches like Fisher. Ryan. Belichick. Kiffin. Phillips. Rivera. LeBeau. Coaches. Cornell, Capers, Lewis, the late Jim Johnson, and so many more. I always felt like I was kind of playing against that middle linebacker or that safety or that defensive coach. I miss figuring out blitzes with Jeff Saturday, 
Reggie sitting on top of the bench next to me <laughs> and perfecting a fake handoff to Edgerman James. I miss Demarius Thomas telling me that he loved me and thanking me for coming to Denver after every touchdown I threw to him. I miss putting in a play with Tom Moore and Adam Gase that ends in a touchdown. And afterwards, I'll miss recapping the game with my dad and checking to see if the Giants won and calling Eli. Oh, is it his brother? Just that handshake with Tom Brady. Looks like him. I miss playing in front of so many great fans, both at home and on the road. And I'll even miss the Patriot fans in Foxborough. And they should miss me because they sure did get a lot of wins off of me. Hmm. And this is important. Football fans everywhere need to know how much they've meant to me over the years. Fans, you're at the core of what makes this game remarkable. I love it. Who's your I favorite love it. football player? My dad. Your dad's your favorite football player, too? Well, you're on the right track. You're going to be a football player when you grow up? Mm -hmm. Football has taught me mm -hmm. not to be led by obstructions and setbacks, but instead to be led by dreams. Yep. Due to some good genes, I'm smart enough to know that those lessons can enrich who I am and where I go from here. I'm totally convinced that the end of my football career is just the beginning of something I haven't even discovered yet. Pundits will speculate that my effort and drive over the past 18 years were about mastery and about working to master every aspect wow. of the NFL game. Good career. Well, don't believe them. Because every moment, every drop of sweat, every bleary-eyed night of preparation, every note I took, and every frame of film I watched was about one thing. Reverence for this game. Oh, imagine that. Knowing it was your last game. I know without a doubt that I gave everything I had to help my team In the Super Bowl. with a win. There were other players who were more talented, but there was no one who could out-prepare me. And because of that, I have no regrets. There's a scripture reading, 2 Timothy 4, 7. I have fought the good fight, and I have finished the race. I have kept the faith. I know the scripture. Well, I fought a good fight. I have finished my football race. And after 18 years, it's time. God bless all of you, and God bless football. Good on you, brother. Champion right there. Real champion. Wow, that was awesome. Another legend of the game. Been and gone, left his mark. Took a few Lombardies home. Special player. I need to watch like his career highlights and stuff like that because I've only seen him in um, Super Bowl 50 and maybe a couple of other like reaction videos where I saw some of his passes and stuff. But that was really, really cool. He, I mean. 18 years seems like a long time, but really, you know, in the grand scheme of things, it's a pretty short amount of time, you know, and you grow up and that's like your dream, you know, to be a professional athlete, and then you reach that point and it's like your dream is over, essentially. I mean, you got to live your dream, but it's still it's still all over. So I can understand his emotions and, and his reflection. I really like that. That was awesome. I enjoyed it. Oh yeah, and I picked up this nifty little jumper from a store in the mall here. Couldn't say no. Good deal. Nice. I'm going to get some um, players jerseys as well. I'm going to pick some jerseys up. I've already got a couple of players in mind, so I'm going to I'm going to see what I can do. See, if, look around for a for a place that sells them. I know that you can't get them in New Zealand, so I'm just going to look online for them. But yeah, I'll start wearing them in my videos and stuff like that. So yeah, that'll be cool. Can't wait. Looking forward to that. So yeah, if you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you in the next video. See you later.